great, thank you. Um, yeah, I'm really happy. Um, I went out there and I executed my race, which, I mean, it's rude to say the word execute so often, it gets kind of boring, but um, yeah, I was just so happy that I went out there and ran the race that I knew that I was capable of. Today I told myself, look, you're here to win. I'm not taking any less. <laughs> that's what I'm, oh, sorry, that's what I'm here for. And um, I'm so happy to have done that in 1085. Uh, to be uh, kind of, but to be honest, I wasn't really thinking about it. I was just thinking about all my phases, and when I kind of got with about 30 to go, I couldn't feel anybody, and I was like, "Look, keep running, because this is when you think you can't feel anybody. That's when somebody comes and runs straight past you." So um, yeah, I just meant to maintain my focus, keep running, and well, obviously keep running. But um, yeah, I'm so happy. <laughs> with you at the, the warm-up track and yeah. you were just sort of sitting in the dugout fanning yourself. I was yourself. chilled, yeah, because um, I felt like I was in good shape. I mean, and then for me, I've worked out over the years that I have to be chilled to run good. Like, that's me, that's how I work. Some people, they have to be really serious, really, I mean, obviously you're serious and focused, but some people have to be, like, nervous and kind of scared, sorry. But for me, I just have to be happy. I have to be in a good mood. So I'm listening to my favourite music, having a bit of a dance, chilled out. I found out from London last year and just trial and error that a happy and relaxed Dina is a fast Dina. Pardon? It's part one of the treble TikTok. How, how do you feel about, about the I'm other really show? happy, really excited. Can't wait to get going again. <laughs> no, um, I'm going to be happy and let myself celebrate, not celebrate much, but like enjoy like my emotional high or whatever for like another few hours and then come straight back down again and refocus because the 200 I'm going to take it like another championship it's a completely clean slate because I'm only one third of the way there so yeah <laughs> we're going to have to wait and see that's a completely new championship like you never know what those girls are going to bring some of them haven't won the 100 either so we're going to have to wait and see and thank you so much for all your support and thank you so much to the loads of British flags that I was able to see in the stadium today. Honestly, it makes such a huge difference, especially when you're away from home. And yeah, thank you so much for all your support. It does, we do feel it and it does mean a lot. So thank you. <laughs> Tokyo almost at the end of the BBC interview. Do you kind of feel like you can take on, the, you can really take on the best in the world? You've got the fastest time in the world. Does that, does that? Oh, equal, equal, equal. We have to, you have to say equal. I, I cannot claim the first time in the world is equal first time. But um, yeah, I mean, ultimately the aim to double up here is so I feel more comfortable doing it when there's three rounds in both Doha and Tokyo. But we'll have to wait and see. By then you're probably going to have new names, new faces. Hopefully I'll be, I'll, hopefully I'll be one of them. But um, yeah, ultimately we do work in cycles and I'm, I'm building on to Tokyo. A little bit bothered that it was only equal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I wanted a world lead today, <laughs> but I mean, equal, I'll take it, it's better than none, <laughs> it's better than none, so yeah. With regard the 100 and the 2, do you have a different mindset for them both, or they, they're so different? No, I mean, obviously I've got a different race plan, because one's twice the length, <laughs> but um, no, I mean, I've got to go and attack both of them as if, um, as if it's my last race ever, you've got to go and give it your all and leave nothing else on the on in the reserves so um for me one and two just got to go and attack them both a run like that today it's surely gonna be putting you in a good good frame of mind hopefully but it's all about how i recover tomorrow we're gonna wake up tomorrow and i might find out that that actually took something out of me <laughs> i mean I'm a, i feel fine now but you might wake up and be like oh yeah i did run 10 8 yesterday oh <laughs> Too, so that'll be as well. Not all of them, not all of them. Some, some of them that haven't. Trust me, I know, I know my race. <laughs> 200 could potentially still be your better event. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, I mean, uh, yeah, we'll have to wait and see what I kind of go out there and put down. I mean, um, I know that I've got things to work on in the 200. I haven't run as many this year as the 100 because um, I wanted to work on my 100 and get more confident over that distance this year. And 1085, I did that. Very happy. But um, yeah, we're hopefully going to go and see what I can do in the two. We will talk about it, of course, but had you thought about the treble coming into this championship? Um, yeah, because I was in all three events. I mean, if you're entered for two events, you're thinking about double, if you're for one event, you're thinking about winning it. I mean, everybody that stands on the line, doesn't matter if you're in heat, semis, final, you want to win. So being that I'm standing on the line for three events, of course you're going to think about it, of course. Many congratulations. What do you think about uh, Gina, uh, the competition with her? Is it going to be your toughest uh, opponent on the European level for the next year? Well, I mean, years? you've got 
so many talented athletes. I mean, you've got Majingu, you've obviously got Daphne as well being the world champion. So Gina is absolutely fantastically talented, but there are so many talented athletes in Europe. Yeah, and, and do you think that she, uh, on the 200 meters there are maybe even more uh, uh, the competition? I don't know, because I don't really watch my opponents run okay. too much. I'm sorry, I can't give like a confident answer. <laughs> The relays on Sunday. On Sunday, yeah. do you think uh, that this is going to be very tough as well? We'll have to wait and see. But thank you. <laughs>